seconds. Do not let this DQ happen, Raphael. Scary start, but our leader will stay there. Debrito swats Mosquito away like a gnat. Oh, gosh, this guy's nerve-wracking. <laughs> 88 and a quarter. Listen, right, this is why you have to love live sports. You just never know how it's all going to go. No, and it started, It was in the shoe, you know, because this is just a dominant ride. I mean, he he was in total control and then some. That was a fantastic ride, but had it ran down to like three yeah. or four seconds. Yeah, yeah you're going to need a defibrillator, I think, up here if he does that again. <laughs> you, it got scary. I was nervous oh, for you. Oh, man. I saw the sweat on the forehead. Yeah. We might need sports medicine up to the Tractor Supply <laughs> broadcast booth. Raphael, this is a dream that started for you 26 years ago when you were riding calves with your dad. You came into this world title race in ninth with a lot of gold buckles ahead of you. How did you keep that belief and keep that drive to be standing here? Falou assim que é um, um sonho conquistado desde quando você começou lá atrás, com 4, 5 anos de idade com seu pai. Como que é para você chegar aqui sem talvez saber que você podia ganhar e terminar ganhando tudo como terminou agora? É, primeiramente, só tenho que agradecer a Deus muito, porque sem Deus a gente não é nada. E isso é mais um sonho realizado. Eu agradeço a todos que torceu por mim, todos os brasileiros. Vai lá para concentração, Lanche. I just want to thank God for that, make that dream come true. Without him, we're nothing. And it's just, I put in the work, and I came here riding bull by bull, day after day, and with this fan base here to share us up and make us, you know, the one to win, that helps a lot. I just want to thank God and all the fans here today. And as Sean Gleason brings in the Jerome Robinson Cup, and you get to hoist it up for the first time. There was a time this season that you really had to fight. You told me you were thinking of going home to Brazil. The injuries were too much. You didn't know if this was the season to battle. How did you keep that childhood dream alive to be standing here right now? Teve um momento no, no campeonato esse ano que você teve, ficou meio triste, ficou meio para baixo, falou que queria ir embora. Como que você conseguiu virar a sua mente para poder ficar aqui, terminar e, e chegar onde você chegou hoje? Ah, Paulo, eu parei e pensei um pouco na minha vida. É, voltei lá atrás, ver onde eu estava meus erros montando, não estava montando bem. O Ler me aquele e o Péssimo me ajudou, ajudou muito em casa. Fui treinar, fui batalhar para terminar com essa vitória. Uh, I just look way back on my rides, what I was doing wrong, my own mistakes, and I just try to correct it. Péssimo and Ler me helped me, and I just move on and correct all the mistakes and got where I am today. And that's gotten you to holding this cup, the first rookie to ever do it. Rafael Jose de Brito, you are the 2023 PBR World Champion. Congratulations. Thanks so much. That's awesome. Woo! <laughs> All you need to do is look at the smile. There is our new world champion. And the Kubota ride of the day is his ride from round seven. Yeah, and this was a great ride. And remember, he ran it all the way down in the chute. The clock was ticking, but then when the gate opened, the burrito dominated. He ends the week four for eight. But the four rides he will remember forever. These are all our champions in 2023. Wow, man. The burrito just runs the board there riding solo going back to back that bull found it when he needed it here at the world finals well riding solo we've talked about it back to back titles an exclusive club there in the white shirt cord mccoy and again riding solo he has said is the cornerstone of his program well and it really is that boy heard he and his wife both talk about that bull and how much he means to their family and pretty cool to see all the hard work pay off